Hey guys, it's Daniel. Uh, I'm back with another video. Uh, this one is going to be kind of uncomfortable for me uh, because I am quite vulnerable in this video and I was contemplating for a while whether I should put this out on the internet or not. But in any case, um, I have decided to. So without further ado, let's uh, give it a look. Hey friends, it's Dan. I'm back today. Um, right now is November 30th and tomorrow is the big day. It is 11.58 so I'm waiting for the midnight minute to strike because I may, may be, be, be getting into Temple Dental School. We'll see. I probably have a very low chance of getting in but... <laughs> I'm I'm just praying, like I'm I'm just hoping that I get in. But only time will tell. Um I think usually people get the email at twelve oh one or twelve oh two AM. So <laughs> we are getting really close to that time. And uh right now I'm just watching uh Korean fried chicken video. <laughs> How to make Korean fried chicken. I'm just so anxious, like, I swear. Who's this by? Oh, I can't use my glove. Hold on. Use my other hand to scroll. Aaron and Claire. Yeah. Honestly. Oh! Midnight struck. Okay. 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 Ah. Okay, one or two more minutes and maybe, just maybe, if a miracle happens, Please, please. It is 1201. <sighs> Refresh. Let's go. Email. Email. <sighs> if I don't get an email now, it's most likely going to be a wait list for me. Which is kind of what I was expecting, but... <sighs> I was hoping... Okay, 1202 just hit. Nothing is happening. Nothing's coming in. Alright, hey guys. Quick update. So it is 107 p.m. Um, so, what happened was around like 9.20ish during my first class biochem. I got an email uh, for a rejection for EDM. I got rejected. And, uh, well, obviously that hurt. That hurt a lot. You know, EDM was one of the schools that I thought, you know, surely I would have a chance, you know? Obviously, I treated every interview like it was my last. I put all the effort I could towards it. And, you know, even I love the school. I love the philosophy. I love the... the um, message of service and it I thought it was a great fit for me and uh, Just I don't know why it didn't work out. It was just a shock. I, I did not know what happened I still don't know what happened. I don't know anything anymore and I don't even trust myself. I mean It's it's always situations like this where I, I, I sort of trust in my effort you know, I just hope and and pray that my effort is enough and yet it always Never is. I can't understand why this, like, I, I, I don't know. I, I don't know. So, in any case, um, I, I, I talked with a lot of my friends about, you know, what happened. And it, it hurts because I have some friends who got in too, right? So, um, yeah, it's, it's kind of, it's kind of really tough. Um, but everyone's journey is different and hopefully I do find a school that is willing to take a chance on me. Which is... Honestly, like... I thought of any school would be UDM, but... It's just so upsetting that... They weren't. Maybe there were just better people out there, I don't, I don't know. I tried what... I, I did what I could. I really did everything I could, and uh... So... But in anyways, my, my, my friends... Helped me to feel more confident. You know, it's, it's okay. Right, it's fine. 
you'll have more chances in the future. And if not, there's, you know, you can take an extra semester, you can take an extra year. You know, it's fine. But I just can't help, like, uh, so I'm in a much better mental space now. But then I was, like, right after I saw that. But, because I really thought I might have a slim chance, even if it's a 1% chance, I thought just maybe, just maybe, I might, they might give me a chance, maybe. No, no. I, I don't know wh why I even expected, like, a 1% chance. <sighs> so, you know. Onwards, what's the saying? Upwards and onwards, holy. That really took a long time to get <laughs> through. Yeah, upwards and onwards. I just have to focus on my post-Decembers and I am going to, you know, adjust from here. Hello, y'all. It is March 15th and I'm just back. Um, Today was the day I was waiting for. Today was the day that I was supposed to get an, uh, news back from NYU. And like, right now it's 2.13. Um, I had heard that it takes some, usually like for this cycle, my cycle, it takes usually around 13 days for them to get back to people, just from reading the SDN Student Doctor Network threads. And so today was the day at noon. Most people got their news at noon. At, most people got their news at noon. Um, so today I was waiting and, you know, I just didn't see anything. And my spirits were just like in the garbage. So um, finally, I've gotten something back. I just got an email about five minutes ago. And, like, I don't know whether you can tell, but I'm shaking. As you can see, please steady my hands. Like, I don't know whether you can tell, but it, they're shaking. So. I'm so nervous. Because this is... This is the last chance, and this is a moment of truth. I've been waiting for 13 days in uncertainty, and let's just go ahead and open it. There it is. I click it, and that will be the end of this long journey of a year. Years, actually, just my whole undergrad. So... Let me click it. Please. Please, God. Please. Let this be. Let me... Have the chance to succeed. Okay, I'm clicking the button. View update. I've never cried out of happiness before. And I apologize for blowing my nose on camera, but let me show you right now what this looks like. Actually, let me read this. Dear Daniel, congratulations on behalf of the New York University College of Den Dentistry Admissions Committee I am pleased to offer you admission to our four-year DDS program. 
Out of thousands of applicants, you have been selected to join our vibrant healthcare community based on the scope of your achievements and your strong commitment to healthcare. We look forward to cultivate the promise that you bring to the profession of dentistry. Unique and exciting opportunities await you as an incoming member of the NYU College of Dentistry class of 26. Let me read that again. Unique and exciting opportunities await you as an incoming member of the NYU College of Dentistry class of 2026. Superb education and training from expert faculty, vast student research opportunities, unparalleled clinical experience, including rotations in all dental specialty areas, a welcoming, warm, and thriving community that provides you with a large professional network as you progress with your career. As the most comprehensive academic dental center in the U.S., our location along the bustling biomedical corridor and First Avenue in Manhattan affords exceptional opportunities for our, for our students and our faculty. We hope that you will join us as we strive to improve the health of the highly diverse populations in New York City and around the world. Please visit the NYU Welcome Portal for further instructions, conditions of acceptance, and deposit requirements for the NYU College of Dentistry. To accept or decline this offer of admission, you must complete the admission response form on the portal. Once again, congratulations on your acceptance to the New York University College of Dentistry. I look forward to personally welcoming you to I look forward to personally personally welcoming you to our community at orientation in July 2022. Sincerely, Eugenia E Media PhD. I hope I didn't butcher his his or her name. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Holy crud. I gotta call my friends. Thank you to everyone who believed in me. Thank you to everyone who helped me along this path. I'm just so excited. Thank you, New York University. Thank you. You were my top choice. And I get to go there with my friend and with my senior, Sangyun. If you saw my previous video, um, my barbecue video, um, the person I look, to, look up to almost the most is Sangyun. And he's a D1 there right now. So like, this is, this is amazing, right? It's amazing. And, you know, I want to thank, you know, Jaken, Wanjin, uh, Brian, Maher, um, Liv. You know, I couldn't have done it without all of you guys. And there's people I haven't mentioned that are not coming to my head right now because my brain is just, like, in a jumbled state right now. But, really, I want to say thank you. Thank you so much for everything. I really mean it from the bottom of my heart. Hey friends, uh, it's Daniel back again. And uh, today is, let me see, I think April 8th. Correct? <laughs> April 8th, yes. It's April 8th, I'm out of it. Um, uh, I've been struggling with a bug over the past two and a half days. Um, like with, you know, I was thinking either it was a stomach flu or uh, Omicron, but um, I've heard that it's actually food poisoning because several people, um, several freshmen have come down with food poisoning. So it seems like my illness is food poisoning. So I haven't really been feeling that great over the past two and a half days. Um, and you know, I'm obviously behind on many things. But anyhow, I just wanted to come on and tell you guys that I got into USC uh, just as of today, April 8th. And uh, you know, it's really exciting. Um, I I don't know what to say, it's just like crazy. It's crazy to me. Um, you know, so like my mind was set on going to NYU uh, because you know, obviously got the acceptance uh, a lot earlier. Um, but now, um, Things are obviously really jumbled around. I'm not sure what the right choice is. 
And so I'm speaking with my friend who, uh, you know, wasn't intending to go to UDM and she just got her acceptance letter uh, from UPenn today, uh, which is amazing. Uh, it's really crazy. And right now we're just trying to figure out, you know, what the right choice is uh, for either of us. And, you know, for me, I've been thinking about this a lot, but, you know, I would feel more comfortable at USC because it's the West Coast and it's more similar to, um, you know, where I live, which is Vancouver on the West Coast as well. We just all have that laid back vibe, I guess. And so, you know, obviously I feel more comfortable there, but New York City is um, sort of like a once in a lifetime uh, sort of experience living there and, um, you know, feeding off that sort of environment uh, that atmosphere, the vibe, um, I really feel is something special. And, you know, going outside of my comfort zone, um, I feel can have long lasting benefits on, you know, my future as a dentist. So it's really tough. Um, I'm going to take at least a few days to decide. Um, but yeah, that's basically an update on what happened as of April 8th. So um, basically, two acceptances out of four interviews. And these were both from post-December interviews, so don't give up. It's I got both of these post-December interviews in March. I really was, you know, around February, I was kind of thinking of giving up, but uh, that was not the move. And, you know, now it shows. I got into both, so it's crazy. Anyhow, I'll see you in the next video, and uh, peace out.